nation is mounting for today's game, and we've got two quarterbacks looking to make an impact. It's Rodgers Packers going up against Manning Broncos. Now we'll take you out to Lambeau Field where Jim Nance and Phil Sims have the call. The Broncos are back deep waiting for the kick. And Mason Crosby looks set now to kick it away. Fields the football at the three. And they stop him from running it out to the 20. Mark him down at the 19. And here is Peyton Manning coming off statistically the most spectacular season quarterback has ever enjoyed. Setting record 50 yards and 55 touchdowns, leading to another MVP award. Peyton is truly a field general. He tells everybody what to do when he's able to execute it. Clay Matthews at the face of the quarterback. Well, that time the quarterback didn't hold the football, the left just they laps he doesn't even or see it and he goes and play out of the pistol Manning with the give charging ahead a tackle behind the Demarius Thomas turned into Peyton Manning's favorite target in Denver. Well, he's always had the talent, and what he did, he put some knowledge with it. He learned how to become a precise route runner, and when you're a precise route runner, Peyton Manning will find a way to... Makes the... ...field, and to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. ...is not much you can do, but not easy to push downs in these type of situations. The Broncos call for the punting team. Bring them down at the 33-yard line. Now at quarterback, a Super Bowl winning quarterback at that. Aaron Rodgers. We saw last year in 2013 when Aaron Rodgers is not playing for the Green Bay Packers, they are not a very good football team. The best quarterbacks in the NFL, there's nothing he can't do. A nice catch by the receipt, getting past the yard marker. She gets a first down. Lacey lines up in the backfield. Back to the air here on first down. Finds Cobb. He's taken down at the 42. When you throw a slant round, it's really important for the quarterback to make sure he's right in front of the receiver and to his body. Why? So he can make the catch and protect himself. They did it perfectly that time. And that almost got him a first play fake. Has the reception all alone. Receivers, you can't hit the back. And if you give the quarterback this, he is always going to find an open receiver. First down here after the completion. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. Staying with the passing down. Makes the receiver to a halt. As we take a look at the offense, he is a massive man, very difficult to bring down with just one tackler. I think every offense needs a running back just like Eddie Lacy to get those tough yards in between the tackles. He gets it done every single week. As we get a look at this defense, Demarcus Ware, a player opposing offenses, hate to have to face. Oh, my God. He go to line up. We've seen him line up outside. He lines up as an inside linebacker. You know, he dropped back in pass coverage. But when he rushes the quarterback, one of the best in the league. They're going to go 
for it here on fourth and seven. They've come out in the dime package. Throws to the right. Brings it in. Body. Packers decided to go forward down that time and pay off. And of course, the coach, look at him now. He is second guessing his decision. The Packers defense now is going to go nickel. Now, first and ten. Here's the handoff. It's the one who brings them to the ground. the secondary with the Ha Ha Clinton Dix out of Alabama. Just what the Green Bay Packers need. Defensive secondary gave up plays. Not big plays. Game in the NFL, you get a safety that's back there. They can make the tackles and knock passes down. Sometimes when you go on the field, your only goal is an offense. You think, let's first down so we can get away from our end zone, give our punter some room to maybe change field position. So good job that time by the offense. Second down now. The quarter is about to end. Play first. End of one here in Green Bay, Wisconsin. We'll be back momentarily. Start of the second. This will be second down. Manning's setting up now in the pistol. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. It's like this, you think you make a call, you're going to run the football on second down so you can get in a good situation for third. What happens? You lose a couple yards, and now you're in a tough ball. Manning's going to take the snap from the shotgun. No one was open. Picks up. A couple yards. Might have been the punt returner that time. I would have called for a fair catch. Defense was close. All around. To go. Offense lines up here. First down at the 49. Good job by the quarterback. I don't know if they were confused or not. Left side of the offensive line that time, they were not aggressive. They got pushed back, and they give up a sack of the quarterback. The Packers have it at the 44. A new interception that time by Harris. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. Going for it on fourth down. Nelson's in the slot. The Packers have it at the 44. Airing it out. This is going to set up a possession. Packers absolutely do not have a lot of plays in that playbook for fourth and long. So I'm still sitting up here wondering, why did you go for it? First and ten. We'll run it. Here's the handoff. Get back to the line. They'll end up losing one. Good job by the defense. Up has the single back. Has his target. Able to make the tackle about two yards shy of the first. The Broncos that time they can't get big yards, but the throw and catch picks up a few, and his third down's much easier with this situation. Two tight ends on the field here. Anderson's got it on the ball. Very few teams in the league can do this and run the football for first downs. Anytime it's in a situation, third and two, third and three, they don't even think about run. They have to throw it. Nice job of this offense. First and ten. Demarius Thomas. Demarius 
takes the hit and is brought down. You need balance. Now that's what it's all about. Why do you want balance? To keep the defense guessing what's coming next. That play call on first down throw. A nice throw and catch just short of the first down. That's down coming up. Lines up here. Manning's got it in the gun. It's over to Welker. And Wes Welker hauls it in. You throw the football like that down the field, you pick up a first down. Now you can do anything you want on the offensive side, and you've got that defense guessing. Looking across and off the mark on that short. When you see this cover two defense, you gotta know where to throw the football. That time he did not make a good decision. You throw it sometimes deep down the middle. The safeties are not. This quarterback is one of the best game managers in the league. He never forces the issue. That time, down the field, he gets the short control. And now he has a manageable situation. Set up screen. Hard to throw the football down the field once you get in the red zone. That time, the quarterback, well, he knows that. And he looks down there, nobody open deep, throws it short, and he gets a pickup on that play call. Set first end goal to go. In the promised land. Touchdown. 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 Well, the offensive line did it all in this drive, didn't they? Here it is on first and goal. Nice job blocking, and the quarterback finds the open receiver for the touchdown. Broncos ready to boot it down the field. And the tackle's made right around the 26-yard line. The Packers will begin their drive from the 26 now. An extra tight end on the field for this one. First down and 10. And Rodgers will hand it off. And they bring it down at the 38-yard line. Signal for the timeout. And Adams lined up now as a slot receiver. From the gun, Rodgers. I think we've heard this about 7,000 times. It's a passing lead. We all know that, so you got to be able to throw the football and pick up some first downs. First down at the 35. Out of the eye, it's Lacey. That's a gain of eight. The Packers elect to take a timeout here before the second down snap. They went with the ground game on first down, bringing up second. Incomplete to lead in the vicinity. That's what you expect in the NFL nowadays from the players, especially these receivers. They're so aggressive, so athletic. They go all out for every catch. That time, he just let go not able to make the catch but I'll give him an A for effort from the he had it hit knocked it out usually in a situation like this third short the advantage goes to the offense because they can run or throw it well they throw it it doesn't work give a lot of credit to the defense offense still on the field here on fourth down needing three for the first the Packers from the 27. He'll throw it over the middle. Game 17. The Packers call a 
timeout here. They have zero timeouts remaining. Just on the field quite a bit here in the first half. Quarles been called on, and he's been about being a tight end in this league. They got so many options. They get the lineup inside so they can go up and go across the field. They can go up and go out, and also they can run right down the middle. So they have many options to go. Offense lines up here. Third and goal from the five. Pretty tight down in here when you got third and goal. Not room for receivers to work, but the quarterback and receiver, they're on the same page with throw and catch. The mountain kick after this game was just tied before half the scores to seven. Mason Crosby ready for the kickoff. He'll take it. The one. And he's tackled just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22 yard line. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Comes out in the pistol. We'll go down up the middle. Anderson's marked down at the 27. And that wraps up the first half here at the home of the Cheeseheads. We'll take a quick break at halftime and return shortly for the start of the third quarter. The Packers are back deep, ready to return. Harris is going to run this one out. Able to move past the 20 and brought down at the 23. The Packers now will start their drive at the 23. Rodgers by himself in the backfield. First down at the 23. Finds Cobb. Is stopped there. Sometimes they tell the receiver just to go long, run a fly route, run a nine route, because that means straight ahead or a streak. Show the speed that you have and get it done. Rodgers going to take it from the shotgun. Very nearly intercepted. Going to try to avoid the back. Don't throw off that. You have to. When you do, there's just no way you're going to be as good if you had good balance. That time, the throw's off the mark. Wide receivers stacked up on this play. Almost intercepted. Jim, I threw a lot of passes like that, Mike. Where it should have been intercepted, and the guy dropped it. You just go, yes, I got a break. Now can you catch on that break? Roger. Going to take it distance. And in for the touchdown. Good job on that touchdown. That puts him ahead, and it's always, of course, be ahead, then behind. point it's good the Broncos back deep ready to receive Bolden's got a chance for a return and the tackles made right around the 26 yard line The Broncos offense now coming out. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. First down at the six. Anderson at the football. And 
he's going to be tackled right around the 31 yard line. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good. Manning's lining up in the. The Broncos snap it at the 31. And a flag is down. And that's a gain of maybe five. Offside. Defense. He was trying to get an early jump on the play, but the referee caught him in the neutral zone. Loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime. He's back in shotgun formation. No room to complete that one. The quarterback that time tried to squeeze it into tight coverage, but no can do. The coverage is too good, and the football falls incomplete. Manning set in the pistol. Anderson's taking the handoff. This offense can't be stopped on third down, no matter the distance. Big first down by the offense that time. Here in the second half, they're losing a close game, and you get that first down, it just gives you confidence, it opens up the playbook, and it just gives you a better chance of going down the field. To get they're gonna stay on the ground. The Broncos have tried a couple of different ways to get the running game going, but it hasn't paid off. Anderson's been shut down from his very first carry on. No balance by this, like you said today. They can't run the football this all the time. It's not always about just dominating, blocking up front. Running backs have to the part. They have to make good decisions, and they got to break some tackles. Good try. Throw it deep down the field. Oh, but he just goes incomplete. Third down and seven. The defense gets the sack. Good job by the defense. They disguise that blitz. They wait and they time it. And the quarterback not able to make the pass protection change. Able to make that pass protection change. Well, ends up in a sack for the defense. Here's Finds games 11. Being a go-to target, Phil, I think you would three quarterback needs one to back one just like this. But I know this, they need one. I know they all want one. And as a wide receiver, some guys, it doesn't matter. Double team him every single play. They just have the knack and the talent to find a way to get over. Now on the move. With two hands, he has it. To leaves and on. If you look at these passing totals, it's easy to get a sense why they're leading right now. Those numbers are absolutely outstanding. When you see these kind of numbers, that means the play calls were good. The offensive line had an outstanding day, and also the wide receivers. there to make the stop. Good job that time by the off. Power run gets him a few yards. Lacey lines up in the backfield. They'll hike it to him out of the shot. Catch made. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. Good job by the offense picking up a first down there. They've been terrific all day long. They're winning the football game are tiring this defense out. We'll have one more play before the quarter expires. Now first and ten. Up the middle. And two. After the two-yard carry, it sets up second down and eight. Quarles on the right side. Split out wide. He'll take the snap. The first here in the fourth quarter. He's tackled right at the 31. That last play was a run. Third down coming up. Adams is going to get set in the slot for this snap. He's scrambling now. He's looking to the right here. He's got the grab. He's first. That'll move 
the chains. Crossing routes, that's what you want to throw when you see this type of coverage. Four deep, cover four, look for guys across the field. Hard for the defense to cover those throws. Offense lines up here. Down at the 19. Rogers going to take off with it. Catches the ball on the sideline, but does not get both feet down. Nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they can come up with a play that fools the defense. Double tight end formation. Throws to the right. Boykin. That's a gain of 10. Good play. Yard line or the red zone. Find to complete the pass. They did that time. First and goal from the nine. Oh, it almost picked off that time. Jim, the offensive coordinator, has done a terrific job so far here today. He's got his team winning. They're in the red zone. Let's see how clever he's going to be on this call. This long drive continues. Second goal from the nine. NFL. Know that we have seen tremendous comebacks. So when you get the opportunity, lay it on, man. Keep scoring. The Packers line up now for the point after. Add the extra point. The kick is good. Packers now ready to kick the football. No return a knee in the end zone. The end zone. First down, offense readying for the snap. Thomas, a receiver in the slot. Manning out of the gun. Throws the pass. He's got Clinton Dix there to take him down. Sometimes it's good protection by the offensive line, and sometimes it's just bad defense. They can't get to the quarterback, and that's another completion by Broncos from the 22. And here's the pass incomplete. They face third and eight after failing to connect on that last pass play. Anderson's lined up in a sack formation. And that pass is going out of bounds, incomplete. Offense is back on the field. And eight. Manning's going to be in the pistol here. The Broncos from the 22. Going deep. Looking for Darius Thomas. To the good job not being fooled being in position when you're in position you have a chance to make the play that time they did they got the interception to the ground going to lose yards here good job by the defense they stopped the first play that time by the offense now they have a good situation Second down after going to the ground game. The play. Running formation here. Offense in the full house set. Second and 12. The give. Taken down at the 33. Run that time. When you run the football like this, over a period of time, it's going to wear that deep out there's no doubt about it nice job by the offensive line Nelson's lined up in the slot the Packers take it from the 33 the tackles made and the first down is picked up we've hit the two-minute warning in the second new set of downs now after picking up the first for this play, they'll go with two tight ends. 
Leaning on that running attack again here on first. They take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. It's now second down. Offense lines up here. Right back to him. Outside to the run. Miller's there to take him down. And a timeout, so we'll take one with him. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. They bring in the extra tight end. First down, 27. Staying on the ground. And tackled down at the 43-yard line. Defense now signaling for a timeout. Second down. The defense. Again. Bush is there to make the tackle. Boy, they got a good drive going here, Jim. I guess you don't hear that too much on the golf course, do you? The way you hit it everywhere. But this offense, they're, they're making plays that seem to take advantage of, of just moving this football down the field. Here they come. For 20 yards on that last play. Staying with the running game on first down. Game's about three. Defense got to be a little aggressive here. Your team is... You've got to attack this offense. You don't want them to get in there and get another score. And it'll be second down and six after the running play on first down. The defense comes out in the nickel. Gets it again. And straight ahead, Lacey Knighton's in on the tackle. Power running. A lot of teams in this league don't even do it anymore. This team, they can power it up in there and pick up those tough yards. In down. This has been a long drive far. Right back to a four. And that's a gain of 13. Running the football is a mindset, and it's one this team has today for sure. You can tell this was the thought process all week long by the offense. We're going to go out there. We're going to out-tough the other team and just run the football right at them, and it has worked well. They hand it off. Runs it across. Touchdown. Well, that touchdown, the icing on the kick, Jim. Whatever you want to say. Because now the lead's too big. Not enough time for the other team to come back. The Packers for the extra point. Extra point was good. The Broncos' hopes are now and none as they surrender a late score. The score's 28 to 7. Bolden's going to take a knee, so this will come. The Broncos getting set now for their next series. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. First down at the 20. Ball comes out. The offense was able to recover the ball after nearly turning it over. It's second down. Probably wrap things up here. Peyton Manning, look at the field, a takeaway. They bring him to the turf. How much sweeter is practice going to be this week after the win on that sideline? Win, practice is easier because your confidence is high. You feel good about what you've done from the previous cause you won. So he gives you a better chance the following week because you feel so good when you're out there in that practice field. game this truly was.